Hey everybody, this is Amy Allen with Amy's Crazy Creative Life. Uh, this is the video for days 21 through 25 of December Daily, so we're finishing it up for 2011. Um, here is day 21. <laughs> this one's a funny day. Um, if you look at that big old flat tire, um, and there's the picture. My son, of course, wanted to get his picture taken with the tire with a big old piece of plastic jutting out of it. But this was just, um, I wanted to include this because it really helped me be thankful about um, how much worse this could have been, how much more danger we could have been with the flat tire. And anyways, I just wanted to really focus on the blessings and, and how amazing this went. And it could have been so much worse. So... Thanking our guardian angel, that is for sure. So that's day 21, and this was is, uh, let's see, just the acrylic sheet. And then day 22, wrapping paper. Wrapping paper 2011, yay. That's all the paper that I wrote. And um, the Rappy McRapperson, that's actually kind of an inside joke. Well, I guess it won't be anymore, but um, that I have with my family. I always just add, I say that to almost anything, like when it's stormy outside. Stormy McStormerson. Yeah, we're crazy. In this house. Okay, this one. This is really fun. <clears throat> and this is the last Starbucks cup. Okay, so this is day 23. And there's the cup with the sleeve on there. And again, I didn't want to do anything if I didn't have to to the cup and the sleeve page. So I did it all on the other page. So this is the back side of um, the sports card protector page, if you'll see that. Okay, and so here, cookie, for anyone that um, watches a Sesame Street Christmas or Christmas Eve on Sesame Street, he you'll know what that means okay so and then what I did is I put um, these well hold, let me show you how what I did first okay so here is the the base the back end of that sports card protector and then there are more of those super fun um, uh, embellishments I made with my typewriter and just stapled it on there but then I had lots of pictures I wanted to include on this day because um, we had my sister home from England and we were cooking and baking and it was tons of fun. So um, there are these really fun flippable adhesive 4x6 sheets. Um, I've had them for a while but I've never really used them and I thought, ooh, I'm going to totally use them on this. So um, I put two of them on there. So there's one that goes there and then here's more baking and then here's what told all about it so yeah it turned out really cool it's a just kind of a neat little way to add some extra content in there when you need it so I love that day that was a good one okay day 24 again with the, I kind of went a little crazy with those typewriter element or uh, the typed elements but I just think they look really cool so so here's day 24 this is the back side of the sleeve and the cup and this is Christmas Eve, and there's the Christmas story being told, cookies and milk. And then reading the Christmas story again. And then, so this was just the acrylic page. And I had 24 on here um, before, but I really wanted to include this picture of my little boy with the Santa hat on. I mean, like, how cute is he? And so I just stuck a little calendar on there with 24 circled and then here's the journaling on the under underside of the tag for Christmas Eve and then here's big day 25 okay so with this day I had originally wanted to put a um, file folder on there but um, that changed because I realized I didn't put a Starbucks um, uh, bag, the big bags for the year, this year, and I had to do that because I have everything else Starbucks in here. So there's my little boy in front of the tree, cutie pie. And I put again with the typed elements, and then it was Christmas. And then I found a while back 
So I have two five in there with these really cool um, uh, playing cards. I found a deck of Christmas playing cards a while back, and I've always wanted to use them on a December Daily pro uh, project. I did it, I think, one day two years ago, and I haven't done it since, so I wanted to include it this year, and I thought they looked really cute with little angels on there. So, Okay, so here's day 25. Okay. And then I covered the inside with lots of photographs. There's my son and my mother-in-law reading the, the Bible. And then Merry Christmas! And then it told all about it. And there's my son on his little roller racer. One of the toys he got. And then, um, to be honest, I can't even remember how I did this with this middle part. I just kind of cut apart the Starbucks bag and I adhered it. I, I honestly can't remember how I did it. Um, but it turned out real great. Um, I actually, I laminated it a couple times um, to keep it nice and sturdy. Um, and then I put jingle bells on there. And then here's more pictures on there. And then, the end. I, I initially was going to add um, a part in the back um, with the camping trip that um, my uh, husband's family was going on. But then I thought more about it, and, uh, and um, we had already seen them on the 24th and exchanged presents. And so that was more like our Christmas thing, and this was more like a bonus family vacation um, that we took. So I ended up just going with day 25 um, with this album here, but I made sure to include all that with, um, Project Life. So, um, that part is documented. It's just not with December Daily. So, um, that is all she wrote. I cannot believe it's done and over and all that good stuff. But, um, Anyways, um, I have really enjoyed this project this year. Um, the one thing that I really loved is the binder mechanism, making things so easy to turn, um, and all the fun different elements in here. Um, one thing that I've all really also loved doing is including little things that... Um, including things that belong to family. So like this book was part of a an encyclopedia that my dad owned. And then I used my dad's old typewriter to type up a lot of the elements. And with the um with some of the uh old school Dymo labels, I used my grandmother's old Dymo label maker. So it's just it's really fun using those um older hand-me-down um, elements in here um, just you know so that it has a little touch of nostalgia and um, all that good stuff so that make and it makes me happy so anyway so if you have any questions just leave a um, shoot me an email or you can uh, put a comment on my blog and um, I will get to it thanks so much for following me during this project and we'll see you again next year